starting, huh? Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, man. I haven't been in a trial in, like, forever. What you mean, in, in forever? You've been in a trial before? Oh, so you have experience with trials? Right. Yeah, <laughs> since I'm a leader of evil and stuff. <laughs> mm. I've done a lot of bad things. Okay, so why don't you give us some enlightenment? Like, what did you do? Because you it sounded like you did nothing, unless I see some evidence. Because he was Maybe investigating. Maybe he stumbled across it in the library. You know, like how Shuichi did. Hmm. <laughs> wow, looks like you're determined to face even a cold hard truth. Oh, what? Then here it comes, the cold hard truth. We'll spit it out. Huh? Sheesh. I already figured out who killed Rantar. What? Did what? You? Did you? Why are you so Kokichi, are you serious about knowing who the culprit is? Yup. Hmm. So, we all agree that the culprit knew about Kaede and Shuichi's trap, right? Mm-hmm. No shit! That's why they're not in any of the pictures. So who is it? Right. So whoever knew about the hidden cameras is the culprit. So he's saying me, Sherlock Shuichi, and Rentaro? Because Rentaro saw it. So who the hell is it? Hmm. It's you! Who? Oh, what? me? You trying to see her? You oh, no. The cameras oh, used no. for the trap, right? Uh -huh. Obviously, I don't think it's whoever her. Whoever made the cameras knew about the blind spots. I, hmm. I just designed the cameras. Right. I didn't know they could set up in the library. If someone hmm. asked me to make cameras, I'd totally ask what they were for. Hmm. You're getting awfully worked up. Look at you. You're sweating. Oh, he likes to stir the tea. He's a he's a drama starter. I see that. I'm always wet. I'm just feeling extra sensitive. Like these big boobs of mine. Girl, if you just want to get piped down, just say it. Just say it. Just say it. Why don't you just admit harder. it already? Hmm. You're the culprit, aren't you, Mew? <laughs> We're Gilgamesh level condescension. But which Grail War are you from? What? G girl. Wow, another reference we don't get. <laughs> you must be a hardcore loser. Okay, that was a reference I didn't get, but he needs to stop coming for everybody. Before they oh, really sorry. kill him. Sometimes. Yes. How about you just keep your fucking mouth shut, you lying little abortion? <laughs> <laughs> that was really uncalled for. I only said that to find the culprit. Oh, you don't like when people throw it back at you, huh? You don't like it at all. <laughs> oh, whatever. Whatever. You're so mean! <laughs> I love okay. it. I love it. So I feel much. a lot better now. See, look, look. He's so fake. Or, or, I don't know. Might not be fake. Might just be his mood swings. Who knows? Cool your jets, kid. <laughs> Aw, Samuki is so nice. She's way better than Mew. Oh. Oh, oh I've been too. saying it wrong. I've been saying Mew. So it's Mew? Okay, got it. Like like the Pokemon. Cool. If hmm. the culprit is among that group, then wouldn't Maki be the most suspicious? Why she like a killer? <laughs> she could definitely kill someone. <laughs> okay, he's a little funny because she definitely looks like she will bite the hell out of somebody's neck, so I get he's it. So stupid. Uh, I see, so I made a mistake. Oh, she's embarrassed Come now. Where? It's okay. It's you not that wrong. rare for you to make a mistake. Your entire existence is a mistake. And what about you? You know what? Whatever. 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 Vicious little. <laughs> I mean, you basically said the same thing. Yep. A walking, talking Roomba can't compare to a mighty beast like Gonta. Hmm. That Roomba remark ah. is probably <laughs> not about me, as I have a variety of custodial functions. He said, but I caught that shade. See? That's all there is to it. Huh. What? Why are you making this so complicated? Just be the culprit already. Do you want to die? Do you want to die? Sorry. I don't think you need to apologize. Right, don't apologize yeah, for that's that. that's right. Yeah, that's pretty much a lie. Hmm. That means the culprit was Mew all along, since she knew about the intervals. Now I'm thinking that it might be Shuichi too. Like, I, like if it's not Ryoma, I, I fully apologize. But now I'm thinking that it's Shuichi because he left as well he left me and i was over there cleaning in the classroom so he could have done something within that time and now he's saying that he just forgot to tell me about this interval thing so now i'm looking at shuichi too don't be an asshole i have an alibi the 
Remember the dining hall? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Well, <laughs> who else <laughs> knew about the intervals? Uh. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. Who was it again? Shuichi. Shuichi. Right. Uh. <laughs> oh man, this is getting good. Entertain me, peasants. Oh my god. Uh -huh, That's when Shuichi went to kill Rantaro. He could have. No! Oh, by the way, I want to confirm one thing with you, Kaede. Oh? Who set oh? the security sensor on the bookcase? It was Shuichi, right? Oh! Oh! oh. It was! It was. Did you actually controller. check for yourself if the sensor was set on the bookcase, Kayede? Mm. No, I didn't check. Mm -hmm. Did it ever occur to you that Shuichi could have lied about setting the sensor? He could mm -hmm. have. He could have withheld that information. A lie. Mm hmm. Shuichi, you better Shuichi start talking. pretended to place the sensor on the hidden bookcase door. Mm. But in actuality, he was holding it the whole time. And when he met up with you, he secretly triggered the sensor Ooh. to make the security alarm go off. Ooh. Okay, that was nice deduction. That some the security so. sensor was armed, but hmm. the moving bookcase isn't what triggered it. Hmm. As it turns out, Shuichi had it the whole time. Hmm. Only an idiot can make that mistake. Let's see. And he's still not saying anything! Say something! Like, what are you... Oh my gosh, there, oh, but yeah? he could turn it Easy off. Easy to explain. Well, you see, hmm. uh, I guess you're right. Hmm. Sorry, I didn't think that far ahead. But didn't he have the controller, like, like the remote that could turn it off and on, right? You're giving up that easily? Hmm. Yeah, I mean, whatevs. I made a mistake, big deal. You <laughs> speak as if you knew that from the start. Even I was taken in. I was too. I was like, oh, this sounds pretty good. She can't talk. So the ultimate detective is the killer. What a plot twist! You better speak up. Shuichi. Wait. You better speak up. Why do you... Let's go over. I'm the guessing this is the receiver. Okay. I had the receiver. Hmm. Huh? Like, so what? that's why there's no way Shuichi could have turned off the receiver. Hmm. I cannot imagine why anyone would risk their life to lie on another's behalf. Words from a true heartless robot. Oh. Emotions are only for meatbags. <laughs> that is a harmful stereotype. I can produce heartfelt remarks through calculations. Oh my goodness, Kiva. Like less than three? Those kinds of calculations? Mm-hmm. It's Don't say that. and Shuichi are pretty buddy-buddy with each other, so I wouldn't doubt that. Mm. Plus, the way Kaede just acted right now, I'm pretty sure she lied. I know that he knows he's a liar himself, so. A talented liar like me can spot yeah, other people's lies easily. See, yep, he's well, a liar himself, what do you guys he knows. Think? To believe or not to believe, Kaede? <laughs> hey. The trial grounds are gonna morph? Seriously? I totally wanna see that! So. Maybe the shot was on the floor. No. And Mentaro tripped over it, causing him to hit his head on the bookcase? No, 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 no. <laughs> That's weird. Why do you sound so desperate? That's his thing. Kaito, are you done now? Uh <laughs> but if all of that is true, then that's pretty unfortunate. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's Kaede, you know? Mm -hmm. She kept preaching about working together, and then she goes and kills in cold blood. I know. No, something still think. doesn't fit. Oh? Hmm? What doesn't fit? Right. But even if you had to kill someone? Yeah. yeah hey, that's right. I th but... Oh, Kaede, it never dawned on you. As soon as that thought entered your head, Monokuma had you right where he wanted. Because what mattered most to Monokuma is that the killer game started. Really Regardless of your reasons, the moment you felt the urge to kill, you had already lost. You agreed to be part of this killing game when you allowed murder to fulfill your heart. I know that! I know! You don't need to remind me! That's why I'm so pissed off. Pissed off at myself for being so useless. You, well, you were. You were kind of useless. You were. Um. <laughs> Kokichi, that's enough. I can see through your act. Yeah. Whoops, that obvious, that's huh? Right. Yeesh. That seriously was a close one. If Kaede had just kept her mouth shut, we'd all be dead right now. So shouldn't you be thankful? Like, oh my. Okay. On the other hand, she's only in this mess because she decided to say something at that that's moment. Fair. She put so much thought into this, it drove her to commit murder like a lunatic. God, you're such a dumbass. Yeah. And, well, Kaede, you definitely weren't boring. I think we all know who the most suspicious one is. It's mm. Let's combine our power and work together, everyone. Oh. Um, 
the person who's most suspicious is... <laughs> now, let me your energy, everyone, so we can catch the culprit. <laughs> She's not gonna let him talk. Because the murder happened during the magic show, the culprit can only be... Oh. Girl. I'm in form today. Can you stop interrupting? Can you stop? I know you like Himiko. I know she's your girl. But, like, shut up, okay? Tenko. Why are you interrupting me? Right. You can't have a good trial if you talk over me. I agree with you now. I agree well, with Kokichi I'm now. not interrupting you. Not Stop happen. it. There's no way any of that is true. Mm -mm. It's true, though. Himiko used the underwater escape trick to kill Ryoma. Or but somebody used her trick to kill I still have a clue Ryoma. how Himiko did the trick. Hmm. After that, the time ran out. Uh-huh. The tank of our Ryoma opened and piranhas came pouring out. Right. Ah, and he was eating alive. No. Ooh, I see. I haven't checked the Monokuma file yet, so that's news to me. Why not? You lying little brat! Oh Tell my me goodness! What turns you into a degenerate male? This is what she says every so episode. Is think. there a place on stage where the culprit could have hid the body? Yes. Oh wait, Himiko should know since she performed the underwater escape trick. She gotta call her a bitch though. <laughs> It's okay. Judging from it's Himiko's okay. reaction, you hit it right on the bullseye. It's okay, yes. We figured out the but... trick. So basically, no one saw anything. It was really easy to detach that lid. So it's no wonder they used it as a divider. Hey, thanks for telling us that useless <laughs> detail. <laughs> okay, I'll, usually he gets on my nerves, but that was kind of funny. What the heck are you saying? That detail was super useful. It's Hanko. Great. Now what are we going to do? We're back to square one. Right, we need to see who's and suspicious. Why are we back to square one? Because any of us could still be the culprit. Jeez! You flunk out a tard school or something? <laughs> no, we did not use that word, Mew. Jeez. Nuh uh. Not everyone. Mm -hmm. We can narrow it down to whoever doesn't have an alibi yet. That's true. And what alibi? I hmm. guess I should have known a dumb whore pig like you wouldn't understand. So let me explain. Oh, don't make her get over that uh <laughs> that stand that she's standing oh, you behind. You call a dumb pig? Oh wait, I forgot. If there's she this much evidence, planning. then there's no that. mistake. The body was hidden in the piranha tank. Mm -hmm. But for someone to plant the body in there with such limited time is pretty tricky. Right. Ding ding ding! Mm. The ultimate detective gets it right again. Okay. Was that sarcasm? How do you know it was before nighttime yesterday? Hmm. Stop asking me dumbass questions. It could have been solved with the process of elimination. Oh? Jeez. Fine. I'll explain it to the itty bitty pea brained bitchlet. Oh my god, I've never heard that insult insult before. I've never heard that insult before. Bitchlet? <laughs> Not only are you a bitch, you're a bitch lit. Like, what the, what the hell? Bitch lit? Right! <laughs> First, the gym was closed during nighttime, so no one could have entered. True. Please. After nighttime passed, morning came. Uh huh. But hiding the body before the show was. Risky. Which theme. leaves only one possibility. It was done before nighttime yesterday. Mm. Anyone who doesn't get this is just as stupid as the whore bitch lit over there. Okay, considering that I chose the wrong time before he said all this, it's, I feel like that is like an insult to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my so goodness. The culprit, that would be the four of us. Uh -huh. Myself, Kaito, oh, and you. And also, Maki. Right. Well, Kirumi, you would tell the truth, even if it screwed you over. Oh. <laughs> I do this for huh. a I was only there for about five minutes. Uh-huh. Why would you even say that, though? Hmm. You're tying a noose around your neck, you know. Huh. What yeah, about Kaito? Have... Only murderers grow out creepy facial hair like mustaches and goatees. Don't be upset that you can't grow any. Okay, don't come for Kaito. Don't come for him. What? My goatee's not creepy. It gives me a glamorous celebrity vibe. It's all right. You look fine with it. Onto went to the gym to catch Himiko and Angie. Five minutes before nine o'clock. Mm -hmm. After I left Gonta's lab, I ran into Kirumi. You sure did. I'm pretty sure Kirumi stayed at the gym five minutes till nine o'clock. I've been saying her name wrong this whole time. Kirumi. I've been saying Kirumi. <laughs> Kirumi. Oh my lord. This information could have been told to us beforehand. It Sorry, have, forgot. But... I definitely didn't keep it a secret to make the trial more interesting. Oh my god. Yes, you did. We forgot. Know. 
It seems far more plausible that you are telling another lie. Right. Unlike robots, we meatbags can't pull out our memories from our hard drive. Oh? Was that supposed to offend me? Right. Your irrationality fills me with pity. <laughs> if I am the culprit, that I like it. Kimo shoot back. Alive. Maybe someone snuck into the gym while Kirumi and I were busy talking. The only mm. ones capable. But there's actually know. one person we can rule out of the suspects list. Oh? Right? There's one person who's totally not suspicious. <laughs> He's like, just save me already. <laughs> what? You? Yeah, not you, babe. Yeah, you can take her off the list. She actually has an alibi. Uh-huh, she was seen by Gonta. Suck it, nerds! Walking around half naked. But why? Who else could it be? But the horny exhibitionist Mew. Oh my god. <laughs> so was she just run, yeah, running around naked while, just because? But at least we got everyone's alibis cleared up. Hmm. We should remember all of this in case we need to recall these events again. I feel like that's talking to me. So, okay. So, oh, okay. So we got that. We got that. that. It's a new clue. No, hmm. we should do something more fun. Oh. And I have the perfect idea. What? What? We narrowed it down to two people. And one of those two is the culprit, right? Hmm. Since we don't have to randomly accuse each other, finding the truth just got much easier. Hmm. So let's find the truth with a more effective method. And hmm. what is this effective method? Right. If one of them is the culprit, then the innocent one should know who the guilty one is. Yeah? I, because yes? if you know you're not the culprit, then you can just accuse the other person. Yes, that is true. Which means there is one person among us who definitely knows who the culprit is. Mm -hmm. To that someone who knows, do your best to convince us. Work harder. Oh. Huh? Work harder? <laughs> Have the two argue for their innocence. Uh-huh. That's how we'll decide our culprit. Okay. Even and... Huh? How would you know who's you lying or not? You guys talk about cooperation and teamwork, but you're all afraid. Oh? You're too scared to point your fingers at others. So you hide behind the word trust. Hmm. How do you expect to find the culprit when you're all worried about each other's feelings? If True. you're planning to expose a liar, then you have to corner them psychologically. Oh? Only then well, you they would reveal know. their true self as a liar, hiding beneath a layer of disease! And you would know, wouldn't you? You ultimate liar, you would know. Huh? If we want to find the liar, I suggest that the two suspects argue against each other. Mm. No more pointless deductions. I like how he said it, All though. All we for them to fight for their lives. Hmm. So let's host an argument that's totally not boring but super fun. Look he has a point, Loki. He does. When we find a contradiction, hmm. we'll scare the culprit until they screw up. That's how a true class trial works. Hmm. Right, Monokuma? Oh, don't you, don't you side with him. A development like that would liven things up a bit. Don't work with him. Yep, I totes agree. Oh my god. You're agreeing with Monokuma? Right. Just whose side are you on? Not ours. I'm on your side. I don't want to die either, you know. Mm -hmm. That's why we need to take this seriously. A hot debate to smoke out the liar. Mm. If you guys need some help getting started, I can give out the first topic. Oh, really? Our oh. first topic is oh. this. Are we finally gonna see people's motives? Are we gonna see people's motives now? Cubs pad. Uh oh. Not just any Cubs pad, but oh. the one given to our latest victim, Ryoma. Oh. When we started investigating, I went straight to his room to borrow. Oh, we're gonna get some uh so some information now. Oh. And the reason why I brought it out just for this occasion is you watched it because already. one of these two had Ryoma's motive video. Dun dun dun. Oh, Maki, both y'all looking nervous. That out, we need to know who this motive video belongs to. Mm. Take a guess, everyone. Whose motive video did Ryoma have? Ooh, who is it? Oh, how did you ever guess? Because I have Kaito. Ooh, I know, I know. It's because the motive video that you have belongs to Kaito. Right. Process of elimination wins again. Mm. The obvious answer was Maki, right? Yep. That doesn't make me the culprit. <laughs> Finally, you said something. He just wanted to get her talking. This is how a debate should be. I only mm. brought up the motive video to make you talk. Yep, he wanted to get her Excuse talking. Me? Okay, now that we got the party rolling, let's get you and Kaito ready to argue. Oh, why can't we watch the video, though? The culprit, then that means the other one is. Got that? Hmm. 
Let's start this extreme death debate. Tear up the other's lies. Rip each other apart. Um, Wait. Oh. Huh? oh? What? Oh? Oh, let's huh? stuff. Really? You're saying neither of you are the culprit? This is why I said neither. Come on. Then what would be the point of this whole debate? A uh, uh, hunch? Hmm. Are you being serious? You do know all our lives are on the line here, right? Yeah. And you're betting our lives on just a hunch? Yes. <laughs> I'm totally not serious. You can't be that stupid, right? Oh. No, he might actually be that stupid. Well, she doesn't like men, Damn so idiot. I mean, she doesn't like men. So we knew that. Idiot. No, Andy. <laughs> hey, don't call me an idiot. Mm -hmm. You too. How could the ultimate detective believe in someone without proof? A hunt. Oh. How do you plan to get closer to the truth without suspecting either of them? Asking Unless you more have questions. evidence to the contrary, these two will remain suspect. So I just have to turn it around, right? Oh. Huh? Oh. Yes. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> it's totally obvious. Maki's so desperate that she has to lie. I don't think she's lying. She wouldn't have spoke up. We shouldn't listen to anything Maki says. Hmm. She's just going to throw out more lies. I don't think she's lying, though. I told you already, we don't need to. I hate liars. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Oh, you hate liars, huh? Well, look in the mirror, bitch. Like, what the fuck? What? What? What is he talking about? You're one to talk. Thank you. Maki, just ignore that lying little degenerate. We'll listen to what you have to say. Thank you. We can listen. Yes. You saw the motive videos. Hmm. Did you tell Ryoma that Maki had his? Hmm. Oh? When nails get oh, now you're quiet. Them, they're either caught in a lie or thinking dirty thoughts. That's what country. happened now, Maki? That's super careless. Hmm. Aren't you scared someone might kill you in your sleep? I'm pretty sure she could fight them all. Well oh. then, why don't we ask Kokichi? Right, because he hasn't said anything. Huh? What now? Yeah, let's talk to you. my question. Right. Well, Kokichi, did you tell Ryoma? Did you? See, now he's not going to say nothing. Here. Look. I don't want to die, right? If mm. you really don't want to die, then you better tell us the truth. Here comes the dramatic turnabout. Oh. Now I'm the one pressured by Maki. You better answer the question. Okay, it's true. Thank you. I told Ryoma. Thank you. Just as I thought. Gee. That's not a bad thing, right? He wanted to know, so I told him. Have okay, that's not a bad thing that you told video? him. Hmm. No, not yet. I was gonna wait until we hosted like a movie screening party. And that's why we we're invited to the second meeting. I just checked who had degree. who's so I could give them back to everyone after. Hmm. hmm. I see. It is. Monkey is I'm lying. just trying to figure it like out. Like I said before, a liar like me knows their own kind. Mm? I'm not lying. As mm. expected, Maki is lying to us. Mm. If you can't prove your claim, then it's the same as an outright lie. Mm. <laughs> I'd be so surprised if Shuichi was a liar, especially after we believed him for so long. Oh, well, we wouldn't be able I to am. trust anyone anymore. Well, it's not like he's lying anyway. Oh, he oh, he knows. He knows that he's lying. He knows that he's lying. Oh, Shuichi, right, he's on here. That you. proves it then. He's Ryoma on here. Ryoma was still alive during nighttime. The liar knows. It's Maybe, I don't know. Musclehead. Even if we injected tons of steroids into you, it'd be impossible. Oh, don't come for Gonta, because he can squish you easily. Sorry, you're right. Don't do that, Gonta. You didn't need to apologize, Gonta. Right. The murder scene would definitely have more clues about the culprit. Hmm. Why didn't anyone realize this yet? Well, it must be the pool then. Now that little turd drowned in the toilet. <laughs> Shut your mouth, you noisy Ew, sow. Oh my God. Ah, sow. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Yoma must have been pretty yummy. They chomped up his entire body, arms, legs, brain. Can we not think about that? Same disgusting things. Right. I don't want to hear it. Thank you, Sango. Crunching texture with the fatty parts just right. Then when they bite down, it gushes. I'm sorry, are you Venom? Like, like, can you, can you not? Stop! Please stop! Jeez. But how? I, knew. I doubt he was ambushed. I'm hmm. pretty sure the culprit got Ryoma by... Hmm. Uh, whoops. Don't pay attention to little old me. I'm just talking to myself. If you have useful information, just freaking say it. Just say it. Just say it. Just say it. <laughs> well, that didn't really give us any info about the crime. Do you know some info, Kikichi? Even if the rope was long enough, wouldn't it be pretty hard to tie them to the windows? 
Hmm. Both? If the windows were closer together, then they could toss the rope across. But they're not. That's true. No. Even if they did connect the windows with a rope, they can't carry a body on just that. They could slide it over, You're can't they? Now. I got it! They oh. can cut the body to the rope and slit it from one window to the other, like Tarzan! Man, what did I say? What did I say? What did I say? I said they used the handcuff to slide his little ass around there. I said it, man. I said it. Ooh. Ooh, Mew, we here. We here, Mew. We here. Oh, my God. The body would reach the gym I said window, it. but it wouldn't land in the piranha tank. Stop making such dumbass comments and keep your smelly breath in your dirty mouth. Oh, 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 he deserves to be on the list after that. He deserves, he deserves it. Well, anyway, it would have been pretty difficult to get that body in the piranha tank. Hmm. He wouldn't just throw it. The trick was a super crucial part of the culprit's plan. The culprit must have carefully placed the body into the tank with their own hands. Huh? But is there really a way to do that? Uh, is Kokichi, there? Kokichi, are you hinting at something? Right. Huh? Hint? What hint? Don't confuse me with your talk of hinting hints. Oh my god. Come <laughs> on. The trial is just getting fun. Mm. Why you gotta ruin it with that slip up? What do you mean ruin it? We're trying to finish this. But I guess now we know Shuichi's what? logic is right on the money. Okay. So if Monkey had never met up with Ryoma at nighttime, it might have been the end for us. Hmm. Oh, I still don't know if Maki is telling the truth or not. Oh, she is. Suichi was lying. Now, we just need to figure out who the culprit is. Oh, I know. Oh, oh, oh we caught you now, What's huh? wrong, Kirumi? Right. What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Hey, what's wrong? Ah. Hey, 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 hey. He's just being annoying now. Hey, do you think Kirumi saw her own motive video? She may have. Huh? The motive video? Hmm. You saw your important someone in danger, so you committed murder, right? Hmm. Are we sure Kokichi isn't the culprit? He could. He very much could be, too. <laughs> I don't know. How rude. From what I remember, the only one who wears black gloves is Kirumi, right? Well, in this game, yes, because there is someone else that does wear gloves. Kyoko, but she's not here, so. There weren't any. Obviously, she would have used them if they were available. Jeez, hmm. Monokuma provided everything but the gloves. That's pretty sadistic. <laughs> but thanks to him, at least the game became way more interesting. Hmm. Thank goodness. Phew, thank goodness we managed to get through the class you trial. Be me. You mean she's not my mom? Hey. No. She was never your fucking mom. Oh. No, it can't be. Say it ain't so. That was just another lie, too. No, no. no more lies, then. You better just tell us the truth. Please yes. and thank you. Does that mean someone broke the agreement and traded you your motive video? <laughs> All right, fess up. Which one of you did it? Close your eyes and raise your hand. What are you here. saying? Hey, why would the one raising their hand need to close their no. eyes? I see. So Kirimi was the real prime minister running the country behind huh? the scenes. I don't think it's odd that an ultimate level talent could be that powerful. I mean, Keyboy's talent lets him pretend to be human, even though he's a heartless robot. How rude. How rude. I am not pretending. I'm still learning. <laughs> I see. And we just stopped Kirimi from doing that because we selfishly wanted to live. Like what that. should we do? Did we just make a terrible mistake? If everyone outside dies because Kirimi is Why? dead, doesn't that mean we pretty much destroyed the country? What do we do? Oh, I see. That's right. We know your motive to kill, but why did you kill Ryoma specifically? Thanks. Because he was easy to kill. <laughs> easy to kill because he was small? Huh? Is it because he was suicidal? Huh? Is, it, is that it? <laughs> huh? What? Wait a minute. If Maki's fault that Ryoma decided he didn't want to live what? anymore. What? Because? Ryoma only gave up on life after you showed him his motive video. Well, since you didn't watch his motive video, I guess you have no way what of knowing. What are you talking about? What's your point? Wait. Wait a minute, you're talking as if Ryoma saw that motive video. Didn't you just say that he only checked the name and didn't watch huh? the video? Huh? Did I say huh? that? What are you getting at? Well, you know. I probably shouldn't say anything, but someone has to step up and speak for poor Ryoma. I told you. Again, what's your point? That he gave up on life because I showed him his motive video? Um, I'll get to that in a sec, but why do you think Ryoma wanted to see his motive video? Because he was looking for a reason to live. Isn't that right, Why? Mom? How do you know that? Well, to live. No. Which means you shouldn't have shown him his motive video in the first place. What do you mean? What did his video show? Uh, Nothing. His motive was empty. Huh? Empty? Yeah. If Kirimi survives, then the nation's future will be secure. Idiot. Maybe his stupid speech is just what we needed to hear. Kirimi certainly looks shaken huh? by it. Huh? Shaken? Because? Aww. Do you really think someone as desperate to live as Kirimi would give up so easily? 
Of course not. In fact, she probably still hasn't given up even now. <laughs> she was hoping that learning the truth would make one of us volunteer to die in her place. Ooh, Kirby, you bitch. You bitch. You really wanted us to sack her. She really, she, she said, you know what, I'm caught. And I'm gonna let everybody else feel guilty and just have them sacrifice themselves for me so that I can live. Ooh, you dirty girl. You dirty girl. Huh? What? But... Oh. But Monokuma would never allow Black to escape punishment, so maybe she wanted everyone to rebel so she could use that as a cover to escape on her <laughs> own. How about it, Kirimi? Am I close? You are the most detestable Cretan I have ever met. You knew exactly what I would attempt, yet allowed me to explain anyway. Kirimi, I, like I can't take this anymore. Even Kirimi was killed so brutally. <laughs> I don't want to do this anymore. Hey, hey. If that's the case, then we really shouldn't show our videos to of each course. other. That was our consensus from the beginning, not including you, of course. Huh? I never do anything like that. I'm still thinking about what Kirimi uh, said to each other. That's right. It's best that we not remember our motives for everyone's sake. Yeah. Hearing you speak of everyone's sake is the least believable lie I've heard so yet. Mean. How rude. I'm always doing stuff for it's everyone's sake. I'm sure you won't believe me when I say stuff like that, so I'll just keep lying. Um, but maybe seeing Kirimi's final moments has just made me change my because. views. She tried to escape until the very end. Running away to live might not be a bad idea. Yeah. yeah. Hey! Oh, hold on, I have to get tell you guys huh? something. What now? Like I said, I'm wiped out. Yeah. Now, now, it won't take that long, so just listen to what I have to what say. Is it? Well then, what is it that you have to say? Mm. Everyone seems to be treating me like some kind of compulsive liar. You get it? But that's ridiculous. There's a way worse liar than me in our group. Huh? Oh, a liar worse than you. <laughs> oh? I'm talking about Maki. Huh? Oh, what? What? What do you mean Maki's a liar? Ah. Maki admitted it during the class trial, remember? Ryoma wanted her to show him his motive video because he was looking for a reason oh, to live. Yeah. But that wasn't the whole story. Ryoma was blackmailing you, wasn't he? Huh? Blackmail? Um... Ryoma just so happened to discover Maki's true identity. So he used that to blackmail her. I bet he said something like, if you don't show me my motive video, I'll tell everyone what you really are. That's why Maki didn't want us to know she met with Jeez. Ryoma. She wanted to keep her true identity a secret. That's why she kept quiet until the very last minute. Wait, what What shit are you making up now? Maki's true identity. <laughs> I've known Maki's true identity the whole time. Oh? Oh? For a moment there, I thought Maki had disappeared. She moved so fast. Did she run? <coughs> oh, shit. You know, mm. this is an interesting turn of events. Uh-oh. But would you really kill me in front of everyone? Are you the ultimate assassin? Hey, Maki, what the hell's going on? Right. Yeah. You can probably step my neck like a twig right now. Huh. That's not your style. Y you would rather kill from the shadows. Right? Huh. Miss Ultimate Assassin. Oh, that's why she didn't want us to get in there. I, I knew it. I was like, is she an assassin? Because she does look like she kills people. I said this before. I think I said that in the first episode. What? And that's why I'm like, why does she have a big ass red door? And because it looks so ominous, like she looked like a fucking vampire. But that's because she's an assassin. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. So we hit, we hit some troops here. When I came to the hallway, a scene more surprising than I could ever imagine unfolded. What? What's going on? Oh my God. Oh my God. No. It's no. Lie. Oh my God. Oh my. I'm going to kill him. I'm going to kill him. I'm going to kill him. I want to strangle him right now, right now. Did I surprise you? We're gonna scream and cry in terror? Huh? What are you doing? <laughs> I'm not lying! It's true! Stupid!